Hello, good morning, everyone. We are live again here at the Cup Coffee Republic. Um, I am Coach Teen, and we are at the home of certified life coaches here in the Philippines. Um, this is DCAP. We are a 24 by 7 coaching hub offering coaching on demand services any time of the day. So presently, because of the community quarantine, our operation is primarily via online and you can reach us through 0917-586-1661 or through Life Coach Philippines. Yep, and I am Co Coach Sean co-hosting part five of Coach Connect, the who of the hour. And we're doing this video ton as a community service to our change agents in the tribe whom we are called to serve first and foremost. Presently, the COP cooperations is limited to take out and delivery services, but our online coaching is nonstop and we continue to reach out to everyone, starting with the life coaches who are certified by the Global Institute for Coaches and Entrepreneurs. So you might be wondering why we are doing the who of the R. Well, this is an initiative to connect and gain insights on the what situation of our change agent, uh, how they are responding to it, and the outcome they want to experience amid the present realities. Yeah, so, and at uh, dahil jan for those people who's watching. If you are a, fa a fan or a follower of Coach Michael, please share this video so other people can be blessed and uh, uh, other people can hear the story of Coach Michael and how she's doing right now. And without further ado, uh, welcome the who of the R, Coach Michael. Um, Coach Michael, please introduce yourself where you are, if you are single or taken. <laughs> Hello po, good morning, good morning, good morning po sa inyong lahat and good morning po sa couple coach na, na, na mag-interview sa akin. I'm very blessed po and maraming maraming salamat po ulit for inviting me sa interview na to. Umagang umaga, no? <laughs> anyway, I am Coach Michael from Tacloban City, from Region 8 po. And currently nasa Palo Leyte po ako ngayon. Kung baga, uh, part siya ng, ng Leyte wherein at uh, yung nangyayari dito is we are ano tawag to, um, ini-implement po namin yung enhanced community quarantine. Opo. Mm -hmm. I am currently working sa law enforcement industry po and I'm very blessed to be part of the frontliners to really help people na na, 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 na ma-minimize yung, yung pag-spread ng coronavirus here in the Philippines, especially here in Eastern Visayas. So, so um, yun, um, since Coach Michael is in the law enforcement, he's really a frontliner. So it's actually a blessing for us, for the, yes. ano ba ang term daw, late 10 years? Palo news? <laughs> Nag-isip na yung oh, term. Late 10 years po, late 10 years. <laughs> late 10 years pa yun, nag-isip. Um, to, to have Coach Michael as her, kasi aside from him being a part of the law enforcement, enforcement he is also a life coach. So, um, Coach, yes. mm. um, Hindi ko na yung situation kasi somehow you're a frontliner so we already know it. Um, what do you think is the value that you can give now as a life coach and also being part of the frontliners? Right, uh, yung pinaka main value ko na uh, somehow I can share na parati ko naman na sinasabi sa ibang tao na uh, at this point in time na sa buhay natin we were able to to really understand the importance of uh, alam mo yun, yung, yung maintindihan natin na hindi lahat ng bagay na kukontrol natin, di ba? Even as frontliners, even as here in the law enforcement, uh, we, we are doing just, uh, or we are doing things na kung ano yung kaya namin. Alright? That's why we have what we call the yung interagency na, na tumutulong din sa amin to make sure na hindi basta-bastang kakakalat yung virus sa, sa, sa area namin. And uh, really, on that point na, na sinabi ko na we cannot change or we cannot control everything but what we can control right now is how we respond to it how we react on it it's the attitude of reaction diba? it's the attitude na pinapakita natin yes. na despite facing this crisis we will be able to still the see the brighter side of it oh, oh, oh. Oh, yun talaga yung brighter side of everything, no? Oh, Coach Jeff mm -hmm. is online. Good morning down, coaches. Hi, coach. ah, galing. Si Coach Jeff is also from Tacloban. Coach, um, yung ano nga, no? yung what you've shared is really adding more, more value to the people. Coach, can, can you share a little bit lang of what you see um, um, 
Jan currently sa situation mo. I think uh, say specifically you would be able to roam around the city no mm. because of your ano okay. because of your profession. But for for the people who um who's not do not have that um do not have that uh, freedom to roam around and mm-hmm. i'm i'm sure you have from some friends uh, kumusta yung feedback nila and also your family members how are they how how are they seeing the situation uh, currently dito sa uh, coach uh, the way how i see those people na na uh, nasa bahay diba sa, through social media or through texting sa sa mga friends uh, what i he- uh, hear from them or receive from them narinig ko na na at least positive naman positive naman sila when it comes sa mga implementation sa mga guidelines na binibigay ng ng government natin or for example sa lockdown di ba bawal lumabas bawal yeah. <laughs> bawal muna ng mga gala-gala uh, somehow dito sa Tacloban City or dito sa Eastern Visayas yung iba po is really cooperating kasi nga sinasabi po namin na uh, please stay at home for us or uh, please stay at home for us because we stay at home for you di ba Uh, as much as possible po, yung, yung pinaka-priority po dito or yung pinaka-the best po na gusto namin makuha from the people is their cooperation. Ito po yung literal na, na nasa bahay ka lang pero makakatulong pa. <laughs> and mm, yun, uh, yun talaga, po, no? stay at home. Mm-hmm. Opo, coach. And as much as possible po, yung ibang tao na nagpipilit po, di ba? Nagpipilit mm-hmm. na despite na may guidelines, despite na, na may rules and regulations na pinapalog. Uh, somehow, may, may, may ilan-ilan lang naman. May ilan-ilan na, na parang hindi clear pa sa kanila yung ibang guidelines. But uh, really, yung cooperation lang po nila. Kasi yung, yung mga nasa frontliners po natin, for example, kahapon po, pumunta po kami sa isang mm-hmm. sa isang checkpoint area wherein tinanong po namin sila kung ano yung experiences nila, ano yung pinagdadaanan nila, wherein they, they really share na parang may ibang tao na nagpipilit tapos sisigawan sila, tapos uh, oh, papagalitan yeah. sila kasi hindi sila makapasok. Oh, pinipilit hmm. nila kung anong gusto nila. But again, there are guidelines na pinapalo natin to make sure, again, to make sure so yung safety, hindi lang nila, but of all the people na, na, na nasa area. Coach, um, yeah. I'm just gonna ride on that. Parang, so, di ba, um, sinasabi nila sa'yo na minsan may mga nagagalit, like, may nagagalit sa inyo. Mm-hmm. Tama po, Coach. Uh, may, meron ilan-ilang lang, Coach. Ilan-ilan. Ilan-ilang po na, na sinasabi nila na may, may importante silang gagawin. And we understand that. Kasi, However, po, yun lang po. Sorry, nawala. Uh, ano yung ko ulit? Um, Di ba nasa frontline kayo? So, you are subject to um, harsh words and all. Pero mm-hmm. aside from that, there would always be the fear of the frontliners. Kasi at the end of the day, it's the service that they have to do. Kaya lang, if given a choice, si, syempre, siguro yung iba sa inyo, ayaw din na nasa front line. Gusto kasama yung family. So, how do you process or how do you help them out dun sa toss na yun na, syempre, somehow, yung iba sa atin may fear being a front line. Mm-hmm. Uh, sa, sa space ko ngayon, Coach, uh, we're in, uh, yung usual na nakukunay ko talaga is my close friends through, through mm-hmm. messenger or through a call. And really, what I'm telling them is, is to really extend yung yung uh, yung patience. Kasi nga, ito yung abrupt na change na pag nung nung, nung nag-start siya, everyone is panicking. Everyone is uh, nasa mindset sila of surviving. And we understand that. Same as sa kung ano yung iniisip nila, ganun din yung iniisip namin is to survive. Di ba? And mm-hmm. uh, what I can do or what I'm sharing to my friends is that I'm just telling them that It, it's just temporary. Diba? Pasok lang mm-hmm. dito, labas lang dito. Eh, yun lang naman, ganun kami na-train, di ba? Pasok mm-hmm. dito sa kabila, tapos pa, eh, labas mo lang dito. And Because at the end of the day, you still have a family na pupuntahan mo, na babalikan mo. And wherein you can really recalibrate your heart na despite of those harsh words, despite of those uh, bad day that you had, you still have a great family na pwede mong puntahan. Wherein you can anchor your your love, your faith, di ba? And at the end of the day, sinasabi ko talaga, please focus your your heart and mind to God. Because sabi ko nga, hindi natin makukontrol yung mga bagay-bagay, but God can control it for you, God can control it for us. Mm-hmm. Ay, yun talaga yung ano, control ko. Coach, yung uh, magpa-press lang ako ng konti if you don't mind. No? Mm-hmm. Um, 
di ba ano Tacloba has been hit by ano Yolanda and you have currently now who who has this um uh, situation where hindi naman siya nature eh well nature pa din siya mm-hmm. pero sa ibang uh, ibang uh, ibang uh, paraan pa- paano ikaw specifically ha- how are you currently responding to kasi because of the past experiences and this now how was life coaching and how were you able to make this situation um kumbaga taking a look at the positive perspective paano mo siya pina-process ngayon sa brain mo especially ikaw kita mo sa frontline and dami mo nakikita diyan and the people na are in fear or have anxiety ikaw mismo since lahat to na, na nai-invite mo siya na, na nakikita mo siya paano mo siya pino-process yung sarili mo para afterwards kumaga positibo pa rin yung perspective mo mo at natutulungan mo yung mga taong sina- kinakasakupan mo so isa to isa po to sa lahat ng pinapasalamat ko no yung being part of uh, the life coach sa pagiging part ng tribe natin yung sa, sa life coaching when uh nakita ko talaga yung difference how i see how i see life how i see the circumstances na meron ako because uh, way back ko in 2013 na uh, hindi pa ako alam mo yun yung yung uh, yung bata yung, yung baby na nautak <laughs> na, na yung mindset ko na pag pag may circumstances na sobrang sobrang mahirap yung mindset ko is mahirap din mahirap mm-hmm. mahirap ko i-process kung ano nangyayari bakit nangyayari alam mo yung nagbi-blame game na ako bakit bakit ako pa mm-hmm. bakit itong circumstances pa yung Stop yung it, no? meron na mm-hmm. pero uh, at at this point in time sa sa buhay ko ngayon i would say na the way how i see it kasi yung ginagawa ko yung ginawa ko in my end yung ginawa ko mm-hmm. is uh, to really go back kung 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 saan yung sarili ko is maging comfortable uh, what i'm uh, what i'm trying to say alam mo yung yung yung, yung perspective ko instead of being negative Uh, mm-hmm. ginagawa ko siyang positive at through through gratitude. Pinapasalamatan ko lahat yung kumagawa. Alam mo yun, yung sa frontliners, yung mga doktor, yung mga nurses na despite of uh, this crisis, uh, we still be able to give thanks or give gratitude instead of uh, ranting, alam mo yun, <laughs> instead yeah. of uh, of negative uh, uh, blaming people of what's happening in our area. Oo, yung, yung maganda coach talaga, no? yung really the perspective of things in life na at the end of the day naman, kung, kung sabi nga ni Coach Mao kanina, yung mind shift mo na the way you see things, kung positibo yung nakikita mo, positibo lahat eh. Uh, I think you encompass very well yung journey mo from becoming a, ano, um, yung from starting and becoming a certified life coach na that really change the way you see and how you respond to things kasi i think yun yung din coach yung ano the, the gift of the profession that we have na ang decide ka at nakakapag-isip ka ng tama na hindi mo muna iimpluwensyahan yung sa paligid mo nang negatibo yun coach yung ano pala um, specific doon sa social media i'm not sure how you active you are sa social media yung doon sa mga nakikita mo um and and doon sa mga stories that's not serving uh, and I, i i would think and correct me if i'm wrong may nagre-reach out din tayo uh, confirming with you kung totoo ba yung news and so on paano mo siya ano paano mo tutulungan yung community mo sa mga ganung bagay na especially yung mga fake news ayun na um... Isang, isa, isa yun sa blessing na meron ako and uh, I was able to get information. Alam, alam mo yun, yung mga reliable information from 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 the sources na na masasabi ko na once I share this, this is not fake. Alam, oh, hindi siya, hindi yeah. siya fabricated. Oh, uh, I'm blessed being part of isang, sa isang section wherein uh, once we receive an information, diba, pinavalidate muna namin siya. And uh, once I share it to others, I make sure na hindi siya hindi lang siya joke joke or hindi siya fake news and uh, really uh, at that i mean at the moment na sini share ko siya uh, yeah. i want to make sure sa kanila na na or sini share ko din sa kanila as much as possible you share it just share kung ano yung tam ay kung ano yung yung totoo lang di ba kung ano yung 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 at least makaka-benefit yung ibang tao Oh, and y- 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 talaga yung need to na so to be able to filter that information no? at nakakatulong tayo at hindi tayo nakakasira mm-hmm. minsan kasi nakakasira diba? uh, Coach Tin, uh, do you have any ano, uh, questions from Coach Michael? Meron um, Coach, if there's one lesson to gain from this um, crisis what would it be? 
well, for me personally, ah, yung, mm-hmm. yung pinaka-great lesson na, na nakuha ko is, yun niya, to be very thankful kung ano yung meron ka ngayon. Kasi nga, uh, hindi lahat ng tao, kung anong meron ka ngayon, meron din sila. Diba? Mm-hmm. And uh, yung, yung value of gratitude is too simple lang. Be- very simple lang siya na, na tinitake for granted ng ibang tao. But just a simple thank you, a simple, a simple uh, say, or tapping a person and saying that uh, I am blessed to have you. Uh, very simple siya, pero at this point in time, uh, parang malaki yung impact niya. Kasi nga, we're, uh, we are moving in a space we're in chaotic. <laughs> yung iba... Hindi na alam ko ano yung gagawin. Uh, yung iba nagpapanik, nagpapanik na. But really, being grateful of what you have, being grateful of who you are, of what you are, is one mm-hmm. thing na value, na, na nasasabi ko sa sarili ko na if, uh, I mean, for me to be able to win this battle inside of me, I have to be very thankful sa lahat ng tao na tumulong sa akin kung ano ako ngayon, kung anong meron ako ngayon, at kung ano yung Diyos, o kung paano yung Diyos kumalaw sa buhay. Ganda lang, ano yung mga coach, no? yun talaga yung uh, takeaway niya dyan na at end of the day, kung ano naman yung binigay ng Diyos, eh, dapat paganda, uh, take advantage natin. Kasi mab- mm. lahat naman ang binigay ng Diyos. Eh. Um, coach, uh, when everything is said and done, yung situation mo, the way you react to things, and how life coaching is able to, to support you and help you in the community that you serve. Kung if you're gonna encompass everything that's happening right now, ano yung ano, kung ikaw lang naman, ano yung isang outcome na gusto mong uh, kakalabasan Ito, after oh. everything is said? Uh, yung pinaka outcome na gusto ko talaga to really see, kasi, kasi ito yung pinaka main vision ko is to really, alam mo yung, yung, yung a peaceful community, uh, aside from being peaceful community, yung, yung, mm-hmm. yung kamaradiri, na ano yun, yung yung despite of uh, those crises na pinipaste natin at the end of the day uh, isa isa tayong Pilipino anak tayo lahat ng Diyos anak tayo ng <laughs> ng ng isang gumawa sa atin and it, yung yung time natin ngayon is is a time of realizing that uh, what we are right now or what we have right now does it matter if what we have in our heart is not clear of of being Oh, of loving, of loving other people, of loving your family, your friends, and those people around you. Okay. Ayun lang, uh, cooperation, ayun, camaraderie. And hopefully, it, it happens, di ba? Kasi ngayon pala nakikita ko, nag, nagtutulungan na yung lahat. Nagtutulungan mm-hmm. na yung lahat ng Pilipino all over the world. Di ba? They are connecting, they are helping as much as possible yung ginagawa nila. They are reach, reaching out sa list mm-hmm. na magagawa nila. Uh, um, and in coach, um, as far as um, our tribe is concerned, um, how can we help uh, further help and support you, coach? Um, hmm. <laughs> All right. Uh, hopefully, you know, after nang after this crisis, diba? Hopefully, uh, I'm praying. I'm praying to God that uh, after this crisis or during this time, or you still be able to con- to connect with uh, with other people or other coaches here in region 8 cuz sabi nga natin every one of us is fighting this battle hindi lang po kayo kami or yung ibang tao but every one of us is uh, facing it and and the help that we need from you is to really just a simple as ayan a simple encouragement especially for our frontliners yeah. it's quite simple uh have a great day it, it's it's so it is something na mapapasalamat na din namin na uh, i think uh, i think the lord na Ah, oh, may nag-text sa akin, may nag-chat sa akin. Okay na to, at least I'll be able to win this day. I'll be able to win this morning na mm-hmm. na may na may happiness sa puso ko. <laughs> okay. We'll do that Sabi coach. Ni... Dito naman kami lagi. Oh. Uh, mm-hmm. Sabi ni Ishi, miss you coach oh, Michael. Ishi baby. Uh, I miss you coach. Ishi baby. Ishi girl. <laughs> Oh, si baby girl or oh, si Ishi. Uh, coach, thank you. Thank you very much for ano, sharing your insight, sharing mm-hmm. your story, share, sharing your experience. Especially, I think uh, people in ano, watching would uh, get a deeper appreciation of what um, what's happening in the front lines. No? Uh, um, especially you uh, being there thing and certainly yung life coaching skills mo would be able to help um, shift the mindset yung ano hindi lahat puro negatibo um, na 
mm-hmm. like may beauty in what we do, eh, what, what's happening right now. Sabi mo nga kanina, yun, may strengthening tips, di ba? It's very important na may strengthen siya. It gives time for people to pause. Coach, um, any final words uh, of, of encouragement and uh, uh, anything you want to send uh, to uh, the people that's watching you, uh, anything you want to share to them uh, on what uh, what they can do to proceed and really live the life in the now rather than, alam mo yun, living in the future. Kasi dapat now talaga eh, everything should be happen now. Ano yung message mo, Coach? Uh, I just want to really take this opportunity you know, to really pasalamatan yung mga frontliners natin sa lahat ng doctors, nurses, and yung, kahit, uh, yung mga garbage collectors, yung law enforcers natin sa PNP, PGNP, and mara- sa ibang agencies pa po na tumutulong. Maraming maraming salamat po. And really, you are re- appreciated. And uh, hopefully, uh, we will fight this battle as one. Yeah. And... And... Mm-hmm. Uh, Again, sabi po ng sabi po ng ng boss ko, sabi, I mean, those people uh, higher than me, sabi po nila na ngayon lang to, di ba? Hindi to permanente. Yung permanente lang naman is yung pagbabago. Things will change in its perfect time, in, in God's time. And uh, let's not lose our focus kung ano yung meron tayo ngayon. But uh, let us be focused of of uh, being the right person to to people. Yeah. So, ang ganda nun, Coach, na parang ano eh, um, you really see the value of living your life the way you want it. And parang to really focus on what you have now instead of dwelling on on what could have been kasi nga wala tayong control. And really change is, change is the only constant thing. That whatever yeah, happens, coach. everything will always change. So, Ano ba yung mas gusto natin? So, Coach, ito lang yung tanong ko sa'yo. Sinasabi mo nga, um, change is the only consta- constant thing. So, who do you want to become in the process? Who do I want to become in the process? <laughs> Alright. Uh, simply lang naman po yung gusto kong maging uh, tao na ako. <laughs> really be, be, be a blessing to other people. Ayun po. Yung, yung pinaka pinaka sinasabi ko sa sarili ko every day that mm-hmm. uh, yung magagawa ko for this day is to be a blessing to other people to let them feel that they, they are valued in whatever aspect yeah. they are being valued they are being cared because um pag y- yung mindset ko is is pag hindi ka blessing sa isang tao it's either you are in stress or diba? and <laughs> i i choose i chose to be a blessing than <laughs> rather than being a stressor and sabi ko nga, everyone is facing a different battles every day. And I don't want to add up another battle for them. But what I can do, I can be a blessing because people really healed through people or people are healed once they are, they meet, once they meet people who are really healed from the inside. Ayun. Yeah, galing, galing. Thank you, Coach uh, Michael from Tacloban uh, City. Um, you, take Coach your Coach. time, stretching your time at this early time. Uh, as we declare healing to our land and declaring blessing to the people, uh, we pray for divine shift and divine reversal to cure for all of our limiting beliefs. And at the end of the day, naman, Coach Michael, ano, di ba? Uh, we already won. Uh, if we see the relationship, it's already strengthening. It's, it's really growing as far as um, the relationship in the families. At yan, si Coach, to be a blessing. And thank you, Coach Michael, for being a blessing to everyone that's watching. And uh, for everyone who's watching, thank you very much for spending a time. Do share this video if you were you feel blessed and we'll talk to you again soon at dahil diyan maglalab bamboo muna tayo Siyempre, alam mo si na, muna ba to coach Michael natin tingnan natin kung paano maglab yeah. bamboo si coach Michael na parang model mm. uh, model model coach Michael lab bamboo ayun si coach coach, coach dapat uh, nasa my heart kaya dapat okay. nasa my heart dapat puso ah oh, okay man. dapat mo lapit yan yeah. oh, lapit Love bamboom. Love bamboom. Kasi papasabog din natin. Oh, with energy. Oh, wa bamboom, love bamboom, love bamboom. Ah, sige, go na tayo. Okay. Okay. One, two, three, go.
La bambu. La bambu. La bambu. La bambu. La bambu. Pisa, 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 <laughs> oh, sabi ni Coach A, stay safe, Coach. Thank you. Thank you, Coach A. Stay safe, Coach. Okay, see you again. Thank you, Coach. See you soon. Pag natapos na lahat. Yeah, see you. Okay.